po Scorpio. Welcome po sa Star Tarot. I hope you are doing well. Ito po ang inyong intuitive tarot reading for the week of July 25 to August 1st. Please keep in mind po ng reading na ito ay for the collective. So, maaari po mag-resonate sa inyo at maaaring hindi. Kung hindi po totally mag-resonate sa inyo, you may consider watching your moon, your rising, and your Venus signs. At baka nandoon na mensahe na para sa inyo. So, just please take what resonates with your situation and leave what doesn't for someone else. Thank you. So, let's call in your angels and your spirit guides to assist us throughout this reading. Thank you. Okay, so kuha muna tayo ng oracle cards and we're going to look into the messages, guidance, inspiration, insights um, that are coming through for you for the week of July 25th to August 1st, 2022. Thank you. Okay, Scorpio, please. Scorpio, okay. So, tignan natin. Rebirth, wow. No matter what happens... You can find new wings rise from the past, accept the positive change that is coming. Beautiful transformation is coming uh, your way, Scorpio. Ang nakukuha kong energy dito, you are going to be like uh, the phoenix rising. So, there is a massive transformation happening in your life. Merong magsasarang mga pinto to give way para sa mga panibagong pintong magbubukas. So, there are new opportunities coming in for you, um, Scorpio. It could be a new job. It could be a new business opportunity, a business venture. It could be a new relationship na papasukin ninyo. Um, some of you are going to end your long time uh, relationship and you're going to welcome a new one. Whatever this change represents for you, um, Scorpio, this is going to be a beautiful change because this is a positive change uh, that is coming in for you. I feel for most of you, may manifest nyo to. This is what you want in your life. Hiningi ninyo to sa Panginoon. Um, request ninyo to sa Divine Universe because this change, I feel, you really want uh, this area of your life uh, to shift so I feel na excited kayo some of you are already feeling the excitement ng pagbabago sa inyong buhay kasi if this message resonates with you Scorpio you know kung anong area ng buhay nyo to uh, na magbabago kasi you are going to do this change you are going to initiate uh, the change in this area of your life so that's beautiful so what else for scorpio so we have mercy let compassion fill your world offer kindness to all living things what you give you also receive so ang nakik ang nakikita ko dito is the giving and receiving energy na paikot lang yan yung energy na yan Sometimes you are going to be the benefactor and some, some days you are going to be the receiver. And I feel in this energy, kayo yung magiging benefactor. Kayo yung magbibigay. Kayo yung tutulong. May mga taong nangangailangan ng inyong tulong, Scorpio, in many levels. And hindi kayo madamot. Hindi kayo madamot. Kaya alam ng tao kung sino ang lalapitan. And... Ikaw yon, Scorpio. You are generous enough to share your abundance with others. Malaki ang iyong puso, napakabait. Meron kang taglay na kabaitan to the extent na most of the time you are selfless. Kasi inuuna mo yung ibang tao kisa sa sarili mo. You are very uh, generous so that's beautiful kasi sabi ng card what you give you also receive and most of the time it comes back to you multiple times pa diba? so that's so beautiful so what else for Scorpio angels and spirit guides what else for a Scorpio for July 25 to August 1st so your next message is prosperity tignan mo 
Focus on the positive and more good will come. We give thanks for blessings and they will multiply. Prosperity begins in the mind. So because what you think is what you create. So if you think of gratitude for all the blessings that you have, for all for everything that you have received already from the divine universe and that is what you are going to attract you are attracting more of that you are attracting more of what you have in your life and dito prosperity you are going to be prosperous um ngayon darating na week is scorpio na dito sa mercy card mabait ka, you are very generous. So, kaya yung divine universe, yung Panginoon, nakikita yung ginagawa mo and you are going to be blessed as well with more of that. So, ito sa card na to, nagsasabi na prosperity is coming your way. So, ipagpatuloy mo lang na maging grateful ka sa kung ano man ang meron ka. Continue to be generous to others. Continue to share what you already have in your life. And that way, you are going to attract more abundance of the universe, more prosperity into your life. So, that's beautiful. So, tignan natin ano pa ang para kay Scorpio, angels, spirit guides. What else for Scorpio? July 25 to August 1st for Scorpio. Okay, so your next card na nag-fly out is Four of Swords. So Scorpio, pagod ka na ba? Madami bang ah, nakakapagpa-stress sa'yo? Dito sa Four of Swords, sinasabi dito na it's time to breathe. It's time to relax your body, your mind, and soul ipagpahinga mo yan kasi exhausted ka na you are physically exhausted and probably you are also mentally and emotionally exhausted maaring sobra kang busy sa buhay mo sa pagtulong sa iba aside from that you are already busy with your own life with your own um, activities like sa iyong duties and responsibilities sa pamilya, sa trabaho, maaaring meron ka pang uh, organisasyon, pinagbobolontaryuhan, maaaring membro ka ng isang organisasyon na nangangalaga sa mga bata is what's coming through. And some of you, ang nakikita ko, Uh, maaaring ang iba sa inyo ay nagbo-volunteer sa isang organisasyon na nagpapakain ng mga street children, nagpapakain din sa mga homeless is, is what I'm seeing so, pagod ka na it's time to refill your cup it's not bad na tumulong ka it's not bad na maging responsable ka sa iyong trabaho, sa iyong pamilya but kailangan mo din isipin ang sarili mo. You have to take care of yourself first para meron kang maibibigay sa ibang tao. So, kailangan mong mag-refill ng cup. Kailangan mong i-restore yung energy mo. Kailangan mong mag-rejuvenate, mag-recuperate para makabawi ang katawan mo sa exhaustion. So, it's time to breathe. Step back a little from from everything from your daily grind hindi mo kailangan ng mahabang panahon dito you only need maybe a complete 8 hours sleep or isang araw na pahinga spend time alone magpamasahe ka maglakad-lakad ka uh, sa park you can do active meditation with nature so yun ang mga mga bagay simpleng bagay lang na magagawa mo Uh, to refill your cup. So, kailangan mo yan. So, ayun. So, what else for Scorpio? Napakasipag mo, Scorpio. Napakasipag mo is what's um, coming through. Masyado kang matulungin, maawain. Masyado kang mapagbigay. So, kaya kailangan mo din magpahinga, okay? Kailangan mo din mag-recharge. 
So we have the Ten of Cups. Wow, beautiful. Domestic bliss, happy family, happy relationship. This is also material success. Lahat ng pangangailangan mo, lahat ng gusto mo ay nasa iyo na. So, napakaganda. This is an um, opportunity din. Opportunity is coming through. So, ma maaring yung mga oportunidad uh, towards a happy family, towards material success, towards a good job, ay maaring pumasok sa iyo in the week ahead. So, that's beautiful. Abundance then Abundance. Sinasabi, oh yeah, right. Because... Um, abundance is coming through here because we also have a prosperity here so wow so wow Scorpio this is beautiful so yung mercy giving and receiving energy prosperity card with the ten of cups so ang mensahe na binibigyan nito sa akin there is really prosperity coming in pera malaking pera Ang, ang dadating sa iyo and not only that happy family is there so abundance of happiness is going to fill your life as well in the week ahead so wow that's beautiful so the abundance of the universe is uh, flowing through you in the week ahead is Scorpio love money time energy dahil ikaw ay magpapahinga din so you are regaining your strength so that's beautiful wow so i feel that yung uh, transformation dito sa rebirth is going to be in your financial um status so isa yan sa maaaring malaking pagbabago sa iyong buhay wow so uh, pagbabago materially financially Maaring ito na yung hinihintay mong financial stability and security. Wow, that's beautiful. And we have the devil card. So, merong unhealthy attachment, no? So, yung the devil card could be addiction. And addiction comes in different forms. It could be, it could be um, addiction to food. It could be addiction to shopping. Addiction to love. It could be anything. This devil card also indicates codependency. Yung devil card kasi is, is an illusion. Ito yung, yung akala mo, attachment mo sa isang bagay, sa isang tao, let's say a relationship as well, or yung sinasabi kong addiction, yun yung unhealthy attachment mo towards uh, something. Akala mo, yun na. Doon na lang umiikot ang buhay mo. But, ang katotohanan niyan is, ikaw lang ang makakapagpalaya ng sarili mo dyan. Because it's just an illusion. Yun lang ang akala mo. However, kung bubuksan mo ang iyong isip, kung bubuksan mo ang iyong kalooban sa katotohanan, sa reality, marirealize mo. Mali pala yung akala mo na pag nakadepende ka na lang doon sa kung anumang bagay na yun, yun na, ang, yun na lang ang makapagpapasaya sa iyo. Whatever this devil energy represents for you ngayon, Scorpio, yun ang magbabago. And that is going to change now. That is going to change for the better now. I feel na yung pagpapahinga mo, yung pagmumuni-muni mo dito sa Four of Swords, that is going to change your mindset. That is going to open up your mind and heart towards a positive change. Mabubuksan ang iyong kaisipan sa katotohanan na mali pala yung iyong akala. Na meron palang mas magandang buhay na naghihintay sa iyo kung ikay kumawala dito sa unhealthy attachment na to. With the rebirth uh, card dito, that is going to change magigising ka na sa katotohanan and you are going to liberate yourself from this illusion na hatid ng devil energy and magiging masaya ka sa iyong buhay with the ten of cups energy dito and I feel that this devil energy for some of you this is um, a Capricorn person na papasok sa inyong buhay that is going to have a great influence in your life uh, in the week ahead so, because the devil 
uh, card is also the card of Capricorn. So, I feel that for some of you, tao tong um, magkakaroon ng malaking influence sa buhay ninyo or magkakaroon ng malaking um, role sa buhay ninyo in the week ahead. So, Scorpio, that's all I have for you for the week. I hope nakatulong ang reading na ito in some way. Please hit the subscribe button if you are new to my channel. And if you are already part of my Star Tarot family, thank you for supporting my channel. I wish you have a blessed and wonderful day. Love and light.